Hey, what is going on everybody, and welcome to Fantasia for today. We're going to be jumping into another session of Epic 7. Now today, i got some more RTA for you guys. And this time around, I'm going to be trying to play with some of the units you've seen before, you've showcased before. Right, uh, Fire Ravi, going to be trying to go for uh, Summer Charlotte, actually. You guys haven't seen Summer Charlotte yet. Maybe we can get some of those games in. If you guys are interested, by the way, in any of my builds, all of my units and their gear, check out the account overview that I just posted the other day. Uh, has every single one of my units, all their builds, all their stats, uh, use them as references, right? Okay, so Huayang Ban, Rimuru Ban, quite nice, I like this. So, let's go for a Raz, and because a Ravi was picked, let's just go for uh, Dien. Right, these two units are fantastic into a Ravi. We can always uh, deal with Ron or whatever that comes here. If he transitions towards Cleave, if he's fighting standard, we can manage. I hope I hope my opponents are playing standard. Um, okay, never mind. They are going for a uh, Cleave, it seems, of some sort. Hmm, so Para being picked out. Really wish I had DJB now, instead of the DN. But nothing stopping me from also going DJB here. Right, DJB and DN. ML Ken! Ooh, that's spicy. Uh, very spicy. So, ML Ken means I'm definitely gonna go Spectre Tenebria. And we will go for. Who else is good into ML Ken? Can't be countered. Landy? Perhaps Landy could work. Hmm, who else can't be countered? Those are like the only two that really come to mind that would be impactful here. Oh man, what else do we go for? Maybe we go for an LQC, right? LQC seems like she'd be fine here. Ooh, should we go see Lilius as well? Now let's go LQC first. <clears throat> we'll just go for this. Let's pick a support unit at the end. We'll see what we go for. See, Lilius is uh, okay-ish. Probably not the best to pick here. I'm dealing with ML Ken, you just really need a bunch of damage. Ooh, Landy. Landy being picked down means I can go Milam, right? Milam can work pretty well into this team. Oh, Kisei, alright. So with Kisei, Milam is no longer on the table as an option. However, is there anything that would be good into this comp right here? I feel like DJB could work, right? I feel like DJB can work. I feel like DJB works. Uh, let's go ahead and ban the Landy. Because LQC can take on all this. Stene could also take on all this. That's just the Landy, right? Oh, okay. So Dien being banned, let's go ahead and put uh, LQC in the back line so Roz can protect him with a barrier. And DJB, he's going to be the Soul Weaver that helps us through this, hopefully. Okay, Wind Rider Kisei, ooh, that's a slow Para, very interesting. You can go for the LQC, yep. Uh, did not manage to strip my LQC here. Which is okay. I can take that. Let's go for this. A little healing action going on. And I think I will go for a defense buff on the team. Seems fair. We'll go for this. Oh, okay. A Ravi gonna be going. Hitting the LQC. That is fine. Do we go for the big bonk here? Uh, I believe so, right? Do we go on ML Ken? Or do we go on A Ravi? I think we go on ML Ken. 
Because A Ravi might be a bit tankier. I think ML Ken's a bit squishier here. Yep, so we should be able to finish off the ML Ken heal up quite a bit, deal a lot of damage. And I think what we do is we go for. Let's go for the hit on Ravi. Okay, Crimson Seed, very nice. So, because it, I went for the Soul Burn on Ravi, because I wanted to proc. If it was a Crimson Seed, I wanted to proc it so that we can go ahead and stun her here. So she's useless for the next turn. Kise can AoE with an S2. Shouldn't kill my Stene, though. We're pretty bulky. And we can go ahead and finish off the Para here. Oh, didn't finish off the Para just yet. Oh, but there you go. We, uh... We got this. Very, very nice. Alright, that's one in the bag for us. Uh, for DJB that turn, I could have gone for an S2, blinded his team, or I could have actually just S1, probably finished off Para. She seemed pretty squishy, actually. Uh, Para would not... Para could not have... Uh, could not have s 3 there for the damage mitigation, because DJB would have just annihilated her with his berry inversion. So I think he was definitely the pick. Alright, first pick here. I prefer second, but as you can see, we won the we won the last game, right? And we're probably gonna lose this one, so Hua Young and C Lilius. So they can definitely go A Ravi and Ron for another another type of cleave. See, there we go. <laughs> There's the Ron. And A Ravi being picked out, probably. Oh no, Dien! Okay. Oh, playing standard, I see. Hmm. That's quite interesting. Dien with FCC. That's a very early FCC pick. So we're gonna pick an Amelia. And we're just gonna go for an Opsig play. Alright, we could also go Alencia. Alencia's pretty good into this team. But we're gonna- oh, but he's gonna pick Alencia. Oh no, never mind. Rimuru. No, Aeola. Okay. Rylan. Ooh. It's a little spooky. We don't go Alencia anymore, because Aeola's there, right? Uh, although I kind of just want to ban the Aeola. How do we deal with Rylet? How do we deal with Rylet? Do we go Rimuru? No. No, we go Rimuru. is pretty good here, actually. Stene could work. Right? It's really Ryla as a solo DPS, so Spectre Tenebria works here. For sure. And do we go Arc Demon? Ooh, Arc Demon seems pretty nice too. Uh, Spectre. What else goes good into Ryla? Briar Witch? No, I don't think I want to go Briar Witch here. I think we'll go Spectre. Let's go Arc Demon. <laughs> I feel like Arc Demon's pretty good into all of these. If he picks Ron, we'll just ban that. Yeah, I don't think there's any need to fight a Ron here. I think we should be okay. Arc Demon banned. All right. So how do we do this? Protect Amelia, and hope that Amelia outspeeds the Rylet. Now it might be a really fast Rylet. Who knows? All right. Never mind. It is not a really fast Rylet. So let's push up the Opsig. Who do we finish off? Do we finish off Dien or the Aeola? I think we finish off Aeola. Yeah, let's finish off the Aeola here. There we go. And we go for an S3. This will push back the Dien because she has a barrier from the FCC. We get to ignore the effect res. Alright. And I think we we'll Oh, okay, and there we go. <laughs> Another fast one. Very nice. Let's keep on going. Hey, maybe maybe the Emperor Dream is actually not gone. Just kidding. Uh, we're probably not going to make it to Emperor this season. Probably not going to try at all, actually, for it. I'm quite enjoying just using some of these fun units I don't get to use very often, right? Um... It's like in the previous videos, you guys saw it, uh, Ravi being used, and I really want to try using Summer Charlotte as well. All right, I really want to showcase Summer Charlotte in a commentary. I did have a clip of her uh, that I got when I wasn't doing commentary, wasn't recording the sound, but I did record the match. Um, Politis C. Lilius Aeolo, that is very nice pre-bans. 
Okay, we'll go for Aeroz here. Hopefully this guy doesn't go cleave. Don't pick Ron. Didn't do it. Okay, DM being picked out. Alright. So I think this team is an A or is an Alencia team. And then what else do we go for with Alencia? Do we go we can pick another support unit later, right? I don't think we need to pick another support unit now. Do we go Spectre Tenebria? I don't think so. Do we go... a Soul Weaver? We can hold off on a Soul Weaver, right? Or do we go DJB? No, let's go Spectre Tenebria. Let's go Spectre Tenebria here. I was thinking of DJB, but we'll wait to see what happens here. Okay, so Hua Young, another single target damage dealer. Can't hit the Spectre Tenebria. Alright, this guy is tanking up quite a bit. Uh, we can see here that this is not going to be easy to break through. Troublemaker crows it as well, so whoever is in the back line is going to be very, very tanky. What we can do is go for... Ooh, should we go for Shu, actually? Shu might be a pretty good option here. Yeah, we can probably go for Shu. Yeah, let's go for Shu here, and I need another uh, sustain unit, so let's go for a Soul Weaver of some sort. Should we go for an Amelia? That we go for DJB Amelia. Let's go for. Let's go for a. Oh, it's tough. Yeah, let's go Amelia here. This is tough. Um, cause Hua Young can still kick me. <laughs> Hua Young can still kick me, and that's gonna be an issue. We can ban a Ravi, and we can- if he goes for another support here, we can just fight Hua Young, right? Oh wait, no. I think we have enough to deal with a Ravi, right? We have enough to deal with a Ravi. Let's ban the Hua Young here. We'll fight the a Ravi. Ooh, Lionheart Surya. Do we have to ban that? Probably. We probably have to ban that. That's a nice last pick, actually. I forgot that she existed. Oof. Ooh, now we only have Spectre Tenebria to deal with the Hua Young. That is gonna be rough. That's gonna be very rough. But can we do it? Probably. Maybe. Maybe we could do it. Uh, if he puts Hua Young in the back with Troublemaker Crozet, no we can't. No more. And he does. Alright, so we're in danger. <laughs> He can go ahead and buff right here, and we're gonna be in big, big, big trouble. Alright, let's go for this then. Let's push up the Alencia to strip all these buffs. Alright. Let's go ahead and do this. We missed on the Hua Young. It's worth the 50 50 shot. Okay. That's a very squishy DN. Whoa! Alright. Do we go for this? Yeah, let's go for it, right? Spectre? No, we did not crit! Oh, if we crit there, it would have been very nice for us, because now we're going to lose Aeroz or, um, or Alencia. We're going to lose one of the two. Going to push up the Aeroz. Okay, anti-crit, defense buff on Aeroz. Going to injury Alencia down a bit. Is he gonna go for Alencia here? Oh, he is! Interesting. Oh, and it finishes Alencia off! Wow, I was not expecting that much damage to come out. Alright, please crit. We missed the first one, right? So we gotta crit this one. Okay, thank goodness. There we go. Very, very nice. Uh, do we have a fighting chance now? Don't know. Don't know. I don't think so. Because Hua Young looking very scary right now. Very, very scary right now. Let's replenish defense buff, and let's heal Aeroz a little bit, because they're going to be going for him. Right, can Spectre do this? Uh, we're going to need to attack buff her with this upcoming Amelia S2. 
Oh, why does why does my opponent get the nice dual attacks, man? That dual attack actually mattered because that took about a fourth of Aroz's health away from him. That was massive. Um, right, so we're gonna go for the Hua Young here because we kind of have to. Right, let's go for this again. The anti-crit is working so, so well. Uh, we will go... Let's go for... Let's go def defense break on A-Rod. Yeah. It's on proof of valor, right? So we can do that. Okay. Very hurt a Ravi. With a lot of debuffs on her, so if I can turn cycle... We'll be in a good spot. Hua Young has one more turn until S3. So Raz... Oh my gosh, this guy's getting so many dual attacks. Uh, Raz is not looking too great right now. Let's go for the attack on Troublemaker Crozette. Okay. Uh, let's go for a strip on the barrier. Oh, that did not work. Okay, Guardian Ice Crystals though, kicking in a little bit. Can Stene do this? Oh my gosh, look at these dual attacks! I'm not... I, I, it was not meant to be. It, this was not meant to be. Uh, the fact that this guy... Look at him! He, The dual attacks that he got with A-Ravi and Hua Young actually made such a huge difference that he's able to kill my A-Raz here. Yeah, that is... Wow. Wow, that is uh, kind of ridiculous. Not gonna lie. This was kind of... Um, <laughs> kind of upsetting. Kind of upsetting. Yeah, there's no there's no reason to, to even play that out because, yeah, clearly, the odds were stacked against us. And I'm not even lying here, right? It's not like I'm exaggerating saying, wow, look at my opponent dual attacking with every other hit. Um, I, I, I think he did. <laughs> I think my opponent dual attacked with every other hit and with Hua Young and a Ravi, right? I mean, come on. Okay, well, I think we would have been fine there. We could have probably pulled through if the um, dual attacks onto Aeroz weren't uh, weren't that frequent. In fact, if none happened at all, that would be great. In fact, if I got a dual attack here or there, that would have that would have helped. If I got two dual attacks with Spectre Tenebria, I think I would have finished off Aeroz. All right. Anyway, uh, Hua Young Band, Alencia Band. That's a two interesting bands. Not sure why. Both of those are banned, but yeah, let us go for. Let us go for. Um, let's go for Dn. Let's first pick Dn. My opponent still has access to things like Aeola and stuff, but because Alencia is banned, I feel a little bit more comfortable picking this. Rimuru and Emil Calric. Okay, so let's go for Roz. Rimuru, huh? Rimuru. That's okay. I'm gonna fight a Rimuru. I think. <laughs> oh, I don't know anymore. I don't know anymore. It seems like sometimes the game will just decide, hey, no, you're not gonna win. And there's nothing you can do about it. What can we do here? Maybe we can go Flitica. Maybe we just go Flitica right here, right? Yeah, let's just go, uh, Flitica. <laughs> Let's go aggressive. Let's take the initiative. Landy beam picked out. All right, that's fine. We can go mill him here. Ooh, okay. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go mill him here. I think that'll work. Let's go mill him. And... Let us go... You know, let's go fire Ravi. Why not, right? Why not? Let's go fire Ravi. Let's do this. This is pre-buff Fire Ravi. Uh, as of recording this, she has not gotten her buff yet. Uh, if you guys are interested, today is Tuesday. So, two days, she'll get her buff. As of right now, none. Alright, Rimuru, Landy, let's see how this plays out. Amelia, Aeola. Yeah, let's go ahead and ban Aeola. I don't really want to deal with that right now. I think we're good. He might be on Flitica. Oh, he's gonna be on Milam. Oh, it's gonna be a Ravi solo. Really now? Huh. Ravi solo. Very nice. 
Was not expecting one of these to, to happen here, but sure. Is Dian gonna be okay? No, let's do this, right? Ravi, two Earth units, right? They're not gonna crit. I, I'll take that back. Let's knock on wood a little bit. Um, we're probably gonna crit Ravi every single time. Alright, let's go for an S2. I feel like outspeeding the C Lilius here, which is quite nice. Let's go ahead and reset the Rimuru. So that he can't do any shenanigans. I don't care about the uh, debuffs from C Lilius, particularly. Right, very nice. Uh, we pushed up the team, actually. This might be okay. Do we just go for a buff here? Yeah, let's go for a buff. Or a push, sorry. Let's push up the Ravi. And let's just go ahead and dual attack into the Landy here. There we go, very nice. Rimuru is going to uh, cut here. We have skill on everyone, so I think we're okay. Emil Kalric can try to push up the see Lilius and stuff. Oh! Oh, look at that! My opponent getting another dual attack! And on Landy, who pushes up her own combat readiness, by the way. Very interesting, huh? Very, very interesting. Let's go ahead and finish her off here. Oh, we don't even finish her off! <laughs> oh my gosh. Right. So. What a wonderful day, isn't it? Okay, Ravi is provoked, but that's okay. Should be okay, at least. Oh, he's gonna push up the team. I'm gonna crit my Raz, finish off the Flitica. Okay. See Lilius getting pushed up. Landy dual attacking, critting my Raz yet again? Oh, I see. I see. Quite interesting. Okay, let's go ahead and pop this. Rimuru does not have any of his skills, thanks to Flitica. Hopefully we can do something here. Okay, I'm gonna go for the attack on Ravi. Let's go ahead and do this. Wow, he gets a barrier replenished on the Landy right before my Aeroz gets to go. Now that's not an RNG thing, he, you know, held on to his skill. And that's fine, that's fair. But explain these crits and dual attacks, man. Oh, and a dual attacks with Landy again. Just by the way, just so you know, see Lilia's dual attacks randomly, right? Dual attacks randomly, just, just so you know. Uh, could have been any of the other units. Just saying. It took anti-crit and elemental uh, advantage for me to not get crit there. Okay. Pushing up Rimuru. Alright, Landy's probably gonna lap me yet again. Alright, see, look. Okay, watch. Oh, okay, no, he's not gonna go for a. Uh, my opponent's not gonna go for a um, dual attack there. Alright, but there's nothing I can really do as of right now. Let's go ahead and hit that. Rimuru's gonna go and steal buffs. So that's fantastic. Landy gets to full burst yet again. Alright. Critting my Aeroz one more time, just for good measure, right? Gotta make sure this this Aza guy really understands his place in RTA. Uh, <laughs> okay, he's gonna buff M.O. Calric, which gives him combat readiness, and... Uh, wow, okay, finally, we, we get a turn. So let's finish off the Landy. Okay, and Dreamer is probably gonna get his S3, and you know, we're, we're gonna lose our Ravi, probably. Right? Yeah, so Rimuru has his S3. Probably gonna lose Ravi here. He's gonna attack the Ravi. Alright, we're counter attacking, cleansing. So Rimuru has like 10,000 buffs right now, which is horrible for me. It's a bigger buff as well. Okay. Strips all our buffs. We're gonna get like 10,000 damage pumped into Ravi here. Which is not great. Not great at all. And he has immunity, so I can't even stun him or anything. 
That's fantastic. Uh, let's just go for this. Alright, so... Uh, does Robbie live? Probably not. No, probably not. Yeah, no, we don't, we don't live at all. Um, that is great. <laughs> great. So, all of that RNG leading up to this. Can you tell me I'm a little salty? Just a little bit. Um, really wish I could get a couple dual attacks here and there that go my way. That would be quite nice. Um, so no, see, no dual, I don't get a dual attack with Roz or anything to strip the immunity. It's okay, we're gonna finish off the Rimuru here. Can I do this? Uh, probably not, because the turn cycling from C. Lilius and Emil Calric is actually pretty strong. Because, like, you'll always be able to dual attack with uh, Calric, right? And we're already in Frenzy 5, so I don't think we can do this, unless... Okay, no, that's not gonna happen. Uh, unless... Let's go for this. Defense buff will help us in the long run, right? Okay, we're gonna use A-Roz's dual attacks here. <laughs> don't think it's gonna work. I don't think this is gonna work at all. And Frenzy 6 Gaming, alright. Frenzy 6, we're gonna get hit real hard. Okay, or maybe not. Now we're gonna get hit real hard. No, it's gonna be a Vigor buff. So he's investing in some damage right now with Vigor. Attack down on my team might matter a bit. Uh, two turn provoke. Okay, so I cannot cleanse. So let's go for this, see if I can defense break here. Oh, very nice. Defense break. Unfortunately, we're hitting the Calric now. And he, he'll probably win this, um, just because I don't have the means. He's gonna attack buff with a Vigor buff, so now they're gonna deal massive damage. Oh yeah, look at that! Finishing off my DN, and now he can finish off my Aeroz. Yeah, so that wasn't meant to be, right? Wasn't meant to be. <laughs> That's so ridiculous. Oh my gosh, I am... I'm dying on the inside right now. I, I don't even want to play this last match, but let's go for it. Maybe maybe uh, something will happen here that will make me want to continue uh, recording. Whew, man. Dual attacks. Alright, C. Lilius Band, A. Ravi Band. Great. So let's see here. We'll go for... Let's keep going for this. I think I think we'll be fine. Man. <laughs> Two stolen matches in a row. I don't think I played wrong. I don't think I did anything wrong in particular. Uh, in terms of my turn order, skill order, and stuff like that. Using the units that I had drafted, right? In When we're in the fight. You can argue about draft phase and things like that, but... When in the fight, I think, everything was as good as it could be. As good as it could be. Alright, Aeola being picked out, so what do I go for? I need to calm down a little, and let's see. Hua Young picked out as well. Huh. Hua Young, so do I go Amelia? Do I? No, I go DJB. I think I go DJB here. DJB, do I go Dilibet? Dilibet might be okay. Let's go Dilibet. Two cleansers into Aeola. Dilibet can also push up my team. Cleanse and push up my team, right? Which is important against Hua Young, because you want to take the turn before her to, to try to snipe her down, finish her off. So that's our main goal here. Hmm. Shoo, huh? Okay, that's... 
That's alright, because I don't have any Earth units I could pick. Oh, and he took my Spectre Tenebria that I really wanted into this. Um, right. So... His team looks like it can be easily controlled, actually. It looks like it can be fairly easily controlled. Do we go Solitaria? We need a unit that can strip as well as... Control, so I think Solitaria might be okay. Yeah, let's go Solitaria. And who else? Who else is a good unit that can strip and also control? Um, okay, let's go Solitaria. Do we go Aramintha? No, right? Let's do it. Silverblade Aramintha. <laughs> Let's go ahead and control this guy. Alright. We'll see how this plays out. Two units, both of them, by the way, on Abyssal Crown. I'm, you can tell I've given up at this point. Uh, don't really care what happens. So whatever this last pick is, might not really matter. Ed! Okay, so... Ed does matter. We can fight the first four. Alright, let's see what happens. We can ban some. Sol Solitary is probably the, the best better ban because she prevents Shu from getting stacks. The Aramintha is a little spooky. Oh, he bans DJB! Alright. Okay. Aeola can cleanse, but she can only cleanse once. So we'll see how this plays out. Huayang. Oh, that's a fast Huayang, though. Oh, my Solitaria is 261 or something. Wow, that's a fast Hua Young. Okay, he's gonna Solber, he's gonna kick that uh, Solitaria. Oh my gosh. And he's gonna finish her off. That is disgusting, actually. Quite disgusting. So what do I do? I think I just have to go for it, right? We let this rip. Wow, maybe if I put Solitaria behind there, it would have been great. Okay, so we went and did that. Let's go for the S3. Break the skill nullifiers. Defense buff the team. Aeola can strip the defense buff, but it's fine, because then Dilibet can go and push up the team. Oh no, he's just gonna push back Dilibet, which is... that's okay. Who do we go for here? Let's go for this. Huayang is going to probably end us. <laughs> I did not expect Huayang to be that fast! That's insane! Alright, let's go for this. Don't you dare counter me. Alright, stun? No, we got some burns though. Alright, Aeola, go for it. Let it rip. And I'm going to go for a Dilibet reset here. Or not. Okay. We didn't get the strip either. Let's go for a silence there. No, oh, nice. Stun? Nice. Very, very nice. Uh, let's go for Aeola. Let's get some more burns on her. If I can, we can finish her off. Oh, so close. So close. Uh, Dilibet should push up after this. There we go. We cleansed. Shu can S3. Huayang doesn't go, but Stenny gets to go, and hopefully this doesn't give him 20 souls. Oh, he's gonna just go for the S2. Oh, yeah, we're unbuffable. We're unbuffable thanks to the, um, to the Aeolas who weren't able to cleanse. Wow. It didn't really matter, though, I think, because Spectre did get the souls from Shu and uh, gets to Silver here. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. So we have to finish off the Hua Young here. Please defense break. No defense break. We did silence her, though. I think we can finish off everything except the Shu. And I hope she doesn't counter S1 into an S2. <laughs> okay, okay. It didn't it didn't go S1 into S2, but you could definitely go S1 here. Alright, can we finish this off, please? No! Snow Crystal. Fantastic. 
Uh, can we defense break? Please. Oh, finally. One thing. One thing that went our way. Right? One thing. Makes me feel a little bit better about the game. But that's enough, um... That's enough frustration for one day, I think. Uh, I need to step away from the game and from recording for a little bit. So thank you all so much for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, subscribe for more Epic 7 content, and leave a comment down below. Let me know what I can do to improve. And until next time, take care.